Kentucky going out of conference tonight after a brutal stretch in the conference. The Cats taking on Louisiana Monroe, a team that nearly beat UK a few years ago, and it's Military Appreciation Day at Commonwealth Stadium. Kentucky's first possession of the game, the Terminator, John Connor. A career-long pickup of 39 yards. Almost gets the touchdown. That's okay. He'd hit pay dirt two plays later. Kentucky on the board first, 7-0. Then the defense making its presence felt. Corey Peters manhandles the ULM QB. Loss of six on third down. Monroe forced to punt. And Randall Cobb returns that punt. 73 yards. UK jumps out to a 14-0 lead. Second quarter. Mr. Everything, Randall Cobb, at it again. This run good for 28 yards inside the 15-yard line. Next play, Cobb takes care of business. 11-yard touchdown, 21-0 UK. But the shutout would not last. The Warhawks strike in the second quarter, cuts the Cats' lead to 21-7. UK comes right back. Will Fiddler dumps it off to Connor. A big first half for Connor. 25-yard touchdown. Cats take a 28-7 lead into the locker room at halftime. This one is almost over, just about done. 36-13, Kentucky leads it with uh, just a few ticks left. Well, a chilly, blustery fall day at Jane Stadium in Moorhead. Not a good day to go shoeless, but Eagles head coach Matt Ballard does. Not because he's crazy. He's without footwear in support of Samaritan's Feet, which provides shoes to children around the world. The band had some shoes to donate as well here locally. And then Coach Ballard trying to get everyone to text that right there. Four shoes to 85944, which results in donating $5 to the cause. To the football game, Moorhead trying to protect a 14-0 third quarter lead against Marist. Wes McDermott doing his part on defense. Then the Red Foxes outfox the Eagles D on this long TD pass to cut the Moorhead lead in half. 14-7. Yeah, Coach Ballard not happy about that. Now in the fourth quarter, the Eagles find themselves trailing. 17-14, trying to mount a drive. Evan Sawyer fumbles right into the hands of a Marist defender. Ball is taken back inside the five-yard line. Would lead to another touchdown. The Eagles lose 24-14. But Coach Ballard notches a victory in the charitable acts category. Is there anything, uh, is anything more important than a child? You know, um, it's God's greatest gift to us. You know, he gave me the greatest son I could ever hope and dream for. And, uh, you know, you just try to make a small difference any way you can, whether it's a kid here locally or in the state or in Nigeria. And that's exactly what we, we've done. And uh, I just thank everybody for their help and support. And, and I just love Samaritan's Feet to death. And uh, they're doing remarkable work. And uh, a, lot, a lot of lives are going to be changed and uh, a big difference in their lives. And I'm just, I'm just humbled and so honored that our guys in this community has, has been a part of that. Well, it was also cold and windy in Frankfurt. Kentucky State hosting Miles College. Thoroughbreds playing some nasty defense. Check out the hit here from Sergio Welch, a D cleater. And that gets the band up and moving around. Yeah, we like those kind of hits. So here's more defense. Edward Dunaway breaking through, gets to the quarterback. A nice sack there for Dunaway. You've seen the defense. How about some offense? Shannon Friesen right up the gut, has a seam. He's gone, breaks a scoreless tie. Kentucky State goes on to win 21-6 on Senior Day. The U.K. basketball team will hold its annual blue-white game this coming Wednesday night down at Rupp Arena. It'll be another chance for solid blue fans to get a look at those speedy guards, John Wall and Eric Bledsoe. All the players rave about the speed of Wall and Bledsoe, how quick they get up and down the floor, how they can blow by their man. And then you have big men like DeMarcus Cousins, who handles the ball like a guard. Returning Wildcat Mark Krebs has been impressed. They're, they're talented as advertised, if you want to say that. They are amazing. They are um, they're fast. They're athletic. Uh, John Wall going up and down the court is probably him and, him and Eric are so fast. They get the ball up and down so fast. It's like I mean, you have to full sprint with them with the ball and you not with the ball. You have to full sprint with even keep, keep, keep up with them. And as far as DeMarcus goes, I mean, he can – he, may, he looks, acts like a guard sometimes, which is kind of funny, but he's, he is impressive. And off the court, they're great, they're great friends. Like, we go eat dinner together every night. We play video games all the time. I mean, we're legitimately, all of us are good friends, which is the best part about it.
Play of the day absolutely has to go to Moorhead State head football coach Matt Ballard on a cold day, very windy. He goes without shoes for more than three hours to support a cause he believes in, getting shoes to kids who do not have shoes. That's why the Eagles barefoot Ballard gets the Jack Kane Ford play of the day. And it has just gone final. Kentucky beats Louisiana Monroe 36-13. We're back after this.